being a homemaker and mother can be hard work sometimes, but I remind myself this is a season of life, so don't give up hope, my friends, if you are in this stage of life as well. Being a younger mom of two little ones, I sometimes feel the stresses of the stage of life, the season of life that I am in, but I know that I need to take every moment, every opportunity to enjoy what this time has to offer for me. So unloading the dishwasher multiple times a week, folding multiple loads of laundry after you're gone for a weekend is something that has to be done and something that I can find joy in when I watch my little girls playing on the bed together while I fold the laundry. So there is just hope in the little things and I've said that multiple times before too but one, two, three, four, five loads of laundry, whatever you have to do, make the most out of them to um, just bring joy in that task that you are doing. just is going to come naturally it's something we all have to work at if you're in those stages Um, and it is something that takes time taking care of your little ones especially if you're like me like I said and you have younger ones it does take more time and so knowing that you are raising your children well by caring for your home doing the best that you can as a homemaker is something that I encourage you in Um, this stage of life and taking those little moments to make special treats like a pumpkin spice latte for yourself taking time to do something that you enjoy is important with homemaking there is also beauty in that so I am redecorating our front porch after we were gone for the weekend because it had frosted but part of the homemaking is teaching my little girl how to add beauty to the home which includes putting out the pumpkins on the front steps again and having her help and redecorating the back porch for the fall as A lot of my pumpkins have rotted from freezing and the mums are dead and gone away with already. So just rearranging things to still make a cute vignette is part of something I love about homemaking. Making your home beautiful, making it a place that your kids see as beautiful and your spouse. And again, having them help you and teaching them well. load number four comes out of the dryer I have a little help this time and we get to have a little fun making the bed too so those moments I have to remember and know that my oldest Nevaeh is going to be a homemaker someday too and hopefully a mother as well and so training her young and having her help alongside is something that also encourages me as well as a mom and homemaker. Making food for my family, as I've said multiple times, is something I enjoy. And for lunch today, we are doing smoothies and popcorn. It is something we typically do on Sunday nights, but we were gone. And so it is Monday, and we're having it for lunch. We all love it. It's something simple, um, and it's just something that I can serve my family and know that we enjoy it as well. Our 
job descriptions can often cover such a wide gambit that I can feel overwhelmed by all the tasks that I want to get done in that day. But if all you get done is folding your five loads of laundry or even one load of laundry, or if you have the opportunity to make a special treat for your family, like these homemade gummy bears, then that is just something that um, you can do as a homemaker and mother and feel good about it for your role and job that you have in what you're doing for your family. of what I am saying to myself as well because I don't want to lose heart in homemaking and in the season when the weather is changing we're going to be inside a lot more with the cooler temperatures I want to encourage you to know that you're not alone homemaking and mothering can be a difficult task but we are in this together and we can care for our families, care for our children, and love on them the way that um, God has allowed us to. So I hope you're encouraged by this today, and don't lose heart.